you. Should beer and wine be served at Gopher basketball and Gopher hockey games? The University of Minnesota President Eric Kaler thinks so, and he has asked the Board of Regents to approve. Should the Regents say yes, or should drinking alcohol not be such a free-flowing idea at college sporting events? Here's a story. The fans in the stands that go for football games can drink beer and wine. That's been the case for several years now. And University President Eric Kaler is suggesting in a memo to the Board of Regents that it's time to serve beer and wine at some other games too. In the memo, Kaler specifically is asking for Regents support in selling beer and wine to general admission ticket buyers at Williams Arena for basketball games and Mariucci for men's hockey. Why not women's hockey? Because the women play at Ritter Arena, and the U doesn't have a liquor license there, so it's not a legal option. So back to where Kaler does want to sell it. A reason why he supports doing this, he said in his memo, is this. Quote, given the intensely competitive sports entertainment market we have in the Twin Cities and the positive results we have experienced with general seating alcohol sales at TCF Bank Stadium. End quote. Translated, perhaps having this as an option will get more people in seats at those basketball and hockey games because those sports aren't exactly selling out. And in modern times, serving drinks isn't all that unusual at college athletic events. Beer and wine were at the Final Four this year for the first time, and dozens of Division I schools do exactly what the U does at football games. They sell beer and wine. Kaler's hope to expand to hoops and men's hockey will have some rules attached if the plan goes through. Drink service would end at halftime for basketball games and after the second period for hockey. There would be a two drink per person limit at each point of sale, IDs would be checked on every sale, and the U would encourage everybody to drink responsibly. So what do you think about the U's president asking to serve more booze? Hit me up on all the internet places right now, but I will let you know also I spent some time trying to figure out how the Regents will weigh in on this issue. Asked all 12 of them, yay or nay on the idea. Three said pretty much yay. One said she's fine with it if there are proper safeguards in place. Two said no comment. And six haven't gotten back to me. So there you go.